Sanam. Welcome, this is Kasmin Mahadev Singh and today we'll talk about the aura and how to keep it strong. So think about your aura as a bubble of energy around you. Everything has this electromagnetic field around them. Your dog has it, the tree in the park has it, the stone, everything has a bubble of energy around it. For a human being, for a healthy human being, the aura should be around 9 feet. Now I've seen auras which are smaller, 5, 4 feet, and usually it's unfortunately but at that time you get depressed, you might get into an accident, your immune system gets weak, and I've seen also auras which are stronger, larger than 9 feet. Usually these are people that are very optimistic, people that have all their chakras working properly, uh, people that are healers, but you can do this with some practical uh, with some practical tips. And here's three of them, how to keep your aura strong. First, be aware of your breath. When you breathe, when you inhale and exhale, be aware of your breathing. This is gonna help you a lot. This actually is gonna expand your aura by a third of it. Learn how to breathe correctly, first of all, so make sure you breathe correctly when you do. Be aware of your breath, that's number one. Number two, look at your clothing and see if your clothing is made of cotton or natural fiber or is made of polyester or some other plastic things that are out there. Just like you wouldn't take a, like an organic tomato and put it in a plastic bag, think about yourself. Something natural that God made and you put it in something you know that's made of plastic. Or polyester let's don't call it plastic just polyester and just wearing cotton and if you can choose color white that's gonna help you tremendously that's gonna expand the aura again by a third we'll talk more about the color white in a different video but just remember cotton versus something you know synthetic and number three you need to get a hold of your mind anyway to be in control Pick a mantra, choose a mantra, and mentally chant it. Or, men or chant it out loud if you like. This is also gonna show in your aura. Everything shows in your aura. Whatever you think, whatever you say, whatever intentions you have, the music that you listen, whatever uh, circumstances, whatever places you go, whatever entourage you have, everything shows in your aura. Your aura is alive. So no matter what's going on, it's going to impact your aura. Your aura, based on your decisions, is going to go large and attract good things in your life, or it's going to get small. If it's small, you might get in trouble. If it's large, it will keep the negative things away and will attract good things, opportunities, relationships, etc. So just do these three things, take care of yourself, and this will show in your aura, and ultimately it's going to show in your life. Sadna. Mm-hmm.